Hello everyone and welcome back to another adventure of Slashy McStabby and Inigo, her crewmate, the Khajiit crew. He's not just a follower, no, he is a brother at arms. Yes. And we want to get another Khajiit follower. Slashy has decided she wants another Khajiit follower so she can continue to have followers do things for her. <clears throat> but she's the hero, you know. Welcome to the Pond Prong. What no, we already do talked to you. We don't want to talk to you. We want to go out. Okay, open Riften. Welcome, everyone. I am um, Adventuring Hedgehog, or just Hedgy. Doesn't matter. Um, and I make Skyrim Let's Plays. And... Oh, I'm reading about the School of Conjuration instead of talking. <laughs> Archery skill. Oh, it's taking a while to load today. Oh, here we go. And here's a beautiful wall. Actually, back in my Photoshop days, I probably would have screenshotted, like, just the wall. <laughs> and used it for a texture and something. I don't know if that's actually allowed. Probably not, actually. Because it's not my texture. Okay, so that wouldn't be allowed, so I couldn't do that, but that would be cool. I would have wanted to, we'll put it that way. Okay, I gotta remember which game I'm playing. I went through my screenshots folder yesterday, took myself down memory lane. Don't miss out. Purchase a bottle of my genuine farmer blood elixir. Only twenty. What do you sell? Eight. I've never bothered to fishing, check what branch I actually sells. Everything I've got on display, really. So I'm curious as to what he actually sells. Okay, just random. Wait, 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 wait. Ah. A water skin. If I had <clears throat> survival mode on, that would be really handy. Maybe we pick one of those up anyway. It's only 18 gold. We still have 40,000 gold. Oh my gosh. I don't even think my other character who's like level 30 something has 40,000 gold. No, she probably does, but... I'm not used to having so much gold, obviously. Hey, girl. You gonna buy something, or just here for training? Oh, that's so Otherwise, rude. Why would you on. say that? She's so mean, though. I need training in light armor. Yeah, I'll I do. I'll teach you how to use it effectively and keep you quick on your feet. Okay. <clears throat> oh, did that push us over? No, that didn't push us to level 11. Okay. All right, everyone, I'm gonna do it again. It still didn't push us over. Well. Come back when you're ready to spend more gold. Live for thousands of years. I guess I should, it would be silly not to take advantage of that though, right? Like, does anybody else not take advantage of that? Because I usually don't. By I'll training. I'll teach you how to use it effectively and keep you quick on your feet. Let's see. Oh, I'm two away from 40, though. Okay, one more time. Now I don't have 40,000 gold anymore. Ha ha ha. And we're still not level 11, so obviously it was not meant to, to be. A level 11 will come when it wants to. 
crush your enemies to dust like a giant. Only a mere 20 gold coins and all this to stay alive. Be Oh yeah, I'm sure for 20 gold, that's really something it can do. It's gonna keep its promises. When met Ramsey, I've come by to browse your wares today. Is it true you chased the beast? Snake oil salesman. Come to see. Looking to protect yourself or deal some damage? Deal some damage? Oh, well, no, actually, I protect myself because I don't need my fists or my weapons. I'm just always looking to deal some damage because I'm so bad at it. Oh, what's this? Oh, but I wasn't going to use magic. So she could be a mystical monk. She could use magic. Ooh, increased shock resistance by 30%. I mean, we have a lot of gold. I don't know. I think the only reason why I'm buying them is because they're enchanted. <laughs> I'm like, should I really? And then I'm like, oh, you have the gold. So I did. What else is magical here? Oh, just weapons. Okay. My horse is not here. Remember, I don't think. Nothing but genuine fire salts will do. The forge knows the dip. <laughs> it wants me to armor a horse that I do not have. But apparently it counts that as me having a horse. So maybe if I arm the horse here, the horse in Falscar will be armored. I don't know. I mean that would be cool. That's exactly what I have. Am I in my stuff? Oh my gosh, I am. <laughs> Sorry. Not paying attention today. My mind is all over the place. And I don't even remember why I'm in here. Oh, because I bought stuff. Okay, pardon me, everyone. Look at that, I've got some magic armor. It's about time. I feel like I got magic armor and just sold it though. That's why I'm so rich. I never kept anything. Okay. Um, oh, I was going to get Branche's quest for some days. You have an odd name for a dark elf. I may be dark elf by birth, but I was raised Argonian. For reasons I'm still trying to discover, I ended up orphaned and taken in by a kindly Argonian family in Black That had Marsh. to be kind of weird. I hope one day to find out what happened to me, how I ended up like that. I mean, I love Argonians. I just, isn't the history kind of bad between them? Do you have any clues about your past? Just one. I know when I was found by my Argonian father, I was wrapped in a blanket bearing the symbol of House Telvanni. It was one of the great houses in Morrowind long ago. Whether that means I was one of them or not, I'm uncertain. If you come across anything in your travels that might provide me with the answers I'm looking for, I'd be grateful. I'll keep an eye open. 
Thank you. Oh, I did level up. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad today. No wonder it wasn't pushing me over because it was already pushed over because I already leveled up to level 11. I totally forgot. Why were you searching in Skyrim? I learned that a matron who had served for House Telvanni had escaped Morrowind during the Accession War. Records showed her barring passage aboard a sailing vessel named the Pride of Telvos. And that's where the trail ran cold. I spent years looking for what became of the ship, but I ended up empty-handed. Okay. Cool. Anything you can find would be of great help. Good luck. Sure thing. Can I interest you in some fine goods from Morrowind? I need to take more screenshots. The prices and the highest quality in Skyrim. Because... I had some really cool screenshots in my screenshot gallery, but um, so many of them I was lazy and I didn't bother to turn the HUD off. Or rather, I was too impatient. Oh my god, my horse! I've got to do things now. We've, we're a team now, horsey. We're going to communicate. I'm going to tell you that I want to find herbs. And you're going to help me collect herbs. Because that seems like a normal thing for a horse to do. Eat herbs, yeah. I don't know. Do horses eat herbs? I know they eat grass. And flowers. And apples. I used to have a pony, <laughs> a little black and white pony named Chubbs, and he was an old man. He like barely did anything, but he loved to graze on at crab apples. We had crab apple trees in the pasture. I'm supposed to be gathering herbs, but I couldn't, wasn't finding any. I was like looking for them on the side of the road and, oh geez, Inigo's not going to like that we're out in the rain. Oh, today he's um, optimistic about it. Okay. Should point my camera out for a better viewing angle. Oh goodness, we've got thunder and lightning. Back to the city. Whoa, we dropped some frames. I thought I turned off. Why did I stop the horse right on top of the deer? That's what I want. Let's ride. We gotta get indoors. Sorry, horse. Good afternoon. Oh, it's not raining right here. Did it stop? <laughs> right here, it stopped raining. But the noise was still going on, so I'm like, what is it, just raining down there? All right, I guess we can get back on the horse. That's right. Marriages to all the cities in Skyrim. Don't forget us. Oh, believe me, I'm your best customer. Um, let's see. Oh, I got one. I didn't even see it.
I don't... Mm, oh! I got more! Now I'm just walking through the brush hoping I'll find flowers. Why am I not seeing them, though? She's picking them up. Oh, I guess my horse is a she. Good thing I didn't name her Horace. She could be named Horace. <laughs> Fancy your chances, eh? Oh, a skeever. We got something else. That's right. Gotta armor you up, horse. I wonder why I don't have the, um... Maybe I have to unlock horse armor before I can unlock the library. Alright, where am I going? Oh, I was going to the Dawn Guard. I'm just randomly riding. Let's level up. Ooh, my stamina is really buffed. Cool, it's time for stamina, though. Um, one hand is up to 46. Nice. Must have got some experience for Yingvar. I wish that would contribute to my hands, but I don't think it does. Because I think the only ones that do are Armsmen and Paralyzing Strike. I am really, actually, I'm not usually this terrible. It's the monk thing. I got to get used to the fighting like that. And would spend 10 levels. I mean, come on, Hedgy, get it together. I'm used to having more reach still. I'm still having to remind myself to get in close. And then you got to get out of there fast. It's difficult. I'm used to... Um, just totally going tank with heavy armor and two-handed weapons. That's my usual play style. Okay, anyway, back to what we were doing. Light armor is at 40. Yes. Okay, okay, yeah. Okay. Sneak. Sure, why not? Wait, is there anything else? Lock picking, pickpocket. Speech is still one way away from 30, so. Lock picking is 24. Ah, I'm one away from apprentice locks. Alright, so I guess it goes to sneak. I'm sneaky. Oh, no wonder I'm like sneaky. I've got points in sneak stealth. Multiple movement now. I've got backstab. Oh, that's right. Yes, yeah, sneak attack six times damage. We're excited about that. Slashy likes that. Slashy has to remember to use her powers more. Okay, we're done. With that, now we're gonna go see the Dawn Guard. Oh, let me enable the quest. Okay, speak with the leader of the Dawn Guard. This is the only thing I should have on my map, so I should be good to follow this arrow. 
Hopefully I will run into a road. Because I know I'm actually going to a cave. And not really the fort. Oops. Let's see if we go up here. Ooh. Oh, wolves! How I missed you! Okay, though, these wolves... Has anybody else noticed that these wolves are pretty pathetic? I mean, I used to think wolves were harder. At least harder than that. They at least... I don't know. That's right. Maybe I need to up the difficulty again. Okay, wait. <laughs> Going wrong way. There we go. I was heading towards this thing that I was gonna check out. Ooh! I harvested another ingredient. Hey, you're a bandit. Now you're a dead bandit. Oh, I missed. The ugly over here. I got that guy. Oh, he thinks he's a king, does he? Amethyst. Okay. So nothing's really in here. It's just a base. Got it. Let's ride. Person. We found the road. We are so good at this. <laughs> Is that a mystical herb? I mean, learn root. Right. Yes. Yeah. We did it! Oh! Hold on, sweetie. I'm gonna leave you here. Where are they? Oh! Down there! Where I was! Here we go. Come here, you little jerk! Thanks, Inigo. I say thanks, Inigo, a lot. Oops, I forgot to start the timer. Hold on a second. Let me check how long we've been recording. Okay, sorry about that. I put a timer on. Ew, I don't want with me. Where did I leave my horse? Oh, look how pretty this is. A little, not even a pond, kind of a pond. It's a little creek right here. Okay, there's the wolves, so where's my horse? I can hear him. There. I can smell it. There she is. Everywhere. 
This land is full of That's right. Press A twice to dismount fast. Oh. That'll be handy. Okay, press right button to whistle. Oh. Stand where your horse can- I can read directions. <laughs> okay, that definitely needs practice, all right. Well, he's already right in front of me. Let me give him some room. Okay. She. Jeez. Okay. We go. She's like, I'm already close enough. Command horse to follow. Follow me. That's a high spirited horse I've got. Purchase traveling equipment from a hostler. Okay. Why do I suddenly have a thousand arrows on my HUD? That's right. Probably can't go in there with the horse. Yep. All right. Fastest mount. Woo! Okay. I should know better than to try to take a horse into a cave. I really should. Okay, so I can't whistle for my horse out here because he can't see me. She can't see me. Join the Dawn Guard too. Hi. Is, uh, I'm a little nervous. I've never done anything like this before. I hope you don't mind if I walk up with you. Hey, uh, don't tell Isran I was afraid to meet him by myself. Not the best first impression for a new vampire hunter, I guess. <laughs> it is okay, scaredy boy. Probably killed lots of vampires, huh? I'm sure Isran will sign you right up. I've actually never I'm seen one. Sure, he'll take me. I hope so. That must be it. Fort Dawn Guard. Wow. Bigger than I expected. Stop. Yes, this place is cool looking.
Let's not bother them. Hey, dude. Well, well. You made it. Good. Ezron's in the fort. He'll get you sorted out. What's that you're shooting with? Never seen a crossbow before, eh? Not surprised. Kind of a Don Guard specialty. Nothing better for putting down vampires. Here, take this one and give it a try. Oh. You'll want to get to know how to use it if you really plan to join the Don Guard. Why did you join the Don Guard? I lost two wives to vampires. I will avenge them. It's good to know That's that I will not have to scary do it alone. That it happened twice. I'm glad this Don Guard exists. All right then. I mean, that seems like a thousand to one thing to happen in the first place. And then to have it happen again? That's terrible. Okay. Where do I go, though? Dear. I just didn't go up far enough. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. New recruits. Hmm. Isran will decide if you've got what it takes. Go on, he's right inside. are under attack everywhere. The vampires are much more dangerous than we believed. And now you want to come running to safety with the Dawn Guard, is that it? I remember Keeper Carset telling me repeatedly that Fort Dawn Guard is a crumbling ruin, not worth the expense and manpower to repair. And now that you've stirred up the vampires against you, you come begging for my protection. Isram, Carset is dead. The Hall of the Vigilance, everyone, they're all dead. You were right, we were wrong. Isn't that enough for you? Yes, well, I never wanted any of this to happen. I tried to warn all of you. I am sorry, you know. So who are you? What do you want? I heard you were looking for vampire hunters. You heard right. I'm glad word's finally starting to get around. But that means it won't be long before the vampires start to take notice as well. What can I do to help? I need someone out in the field taking the fight to the damn vampires. While we're getting the fort back into shape. Tolan was telling me about some cave the Vigilants were poking around in. Seemed to think it was related to these recent vampire attacks. Tell her about, what was it, Dim Hollow. Yes, that's it. Dim Hollow Crypt. Brother Adelwald was sure it held some long-lost vampire artifact of some kind. We didn't listen to him any more than we did Isran. He was at the hall when it was attacked. That's good enough for me. Go see what the vampires were looking for in this Dim Hollow Crypt. With any luck. I'll still be there. Feel free to poke around the fort and take what you need. There isn't much yet, but you're welcome to anything you can use. 
I'll meet you at Dim Hollow. It's the least I can do to avenge my fallen comrades. Tolan, I don't think that's a good idea. You vigilants were never trained I for... know what you think of us. You think we're soft, that we're cowards. You think our deaths proved our weakness. Stendar granted you do not have to face the same test and be found wanting. I'm going to Dim Hollow Crypt. Perhaps I can be of some small assistance to Well, isn't he brave? You there, boy. Stop skulking in the shadows and step up here. What's your name? I I'm, uh... My name is Agmir, sir. Do I look like a sir to you? I'm not a soldier. And you're not joining the army. Get out of the shot, amigo. Yes, sir. Isran. Didn't I tell you to step forward? <laughs> Farm boy, huh? What's your weapon? My weapon? I mostly just use my paw's axe. When wolves are attacking the goats or something. My paw's axe. <laughs> Stand up, preserve us. Don't worry. I think we can make a dawn guard out of you. Oh, there. That's nice. Take this crossbow. Let's see how you shoot. Uh, crossbow? I've yes. never... Oh, there's the timer. Best thing for killing vampires. Just take a few shots. All right, everyone. Uh, we'll stop here for the episode. That's it. I'm going to sit here and let this guy shoot for a little while and then take all his crossbow bolts, too. Handy little tip there for you. <laughs> it's pretty boring. But uh, that part I'll do off camera. So thanks, everyone, for watching, especially if you got all the way this far. Uh, I really appreciate it. And I'm uh, excited that you're taking this journey with me through Skyrim. Boy. Try it again. Through the Dawn Guard. We will be getting to the Saints and Seducers, too, I promise. Um, Watch the that record. just it's hasn't happened finished. yet. Uh, but anyway, that's it from me, Adventuring Hedgehog. So I'll just um, see you in the next episode. And please give a like if you enjoyed this video. And subscribe. Hit that subscribe button for me. I'd really appreciate it. Um, so I'll see you next time. Bye. You need to concentrate, boy. Try it again.